<clears throat> okay, Jake, this is from Wednesday afternoon. And we were working on front toss initially. And uh, you were doing a good job with uh, learning how to shorten your swing. Uh, we talked about why it's important to shorten, shorten your swing. And uh, um, front toss is really one of the best ways for you to work on that mechanic. <clears throat> You'll see you're getting good extension here while I am uh, front front tossing you uh, the ball to you. And that's good. I mean, you'll see the one on the left. It's like the first or second pitch I threw to you in live arm. And you can see you, you stayed pretty short. And uh, then you got good extension on the other side. Um, low pitches and balls outside, the swing's going to be a little bit longer. But for the most, most part, middle inside pitches, you want to make sure you're staying inside the ball with your hands and getting good extension. And the, the catchphrase is, uh, that we use is called, you know, short to it, long through it. And you can see Nolan hitting here on the left-hand side is live arm. He's getting good extension, and both of you are working on that. Now, here's a couple of more of you... Uh, You'll see you're getting a good load. Might be getting a little bit too far outside your your foot, but not not bad. And make sure you let the ball travel and hit the ball square on the when you're doing front toss. Let the ball travel. Take it up the middle for the most part. Okay. Now this is the end of the front toss, and then we started doing live arm and uh, you'll see that most of your swings your left arm really gets long and kind of you know your swings kind of a a long looping swing you know and and that comes from just practicing years and years and years not being told you know to um, work on a short swing so that's a long swing right there And it's, it also makes it harder to be consistent. Makes it harder to be consistent when you have a long swing. I want you to be short to the ball and then explode through it. See how long your arms get there? Low pitches are... Uh, Hard to keep a short swing for low pitches, but um, you know, in that one, your mechanics were better, but you didn't square it up. I'd be more concerned about your mechanics right now versus squaring up pitches. You know, shorten that swing on that one. What that means is just keep your hands closer to your chest when you begin to rotate your hips. When that front heel hits the ground and your hip starts to go, Keep your hands close to your chest, and then when you make contact, explode through it and extend your arms. All right, man, keep working on that, and uh, I'll see you next time.